हेलो एवरीवन टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू सी द इकोनॉमिक इंपॉर्टेंट ऑफ मालवेसी फैमिली सो दिस मालवेसी फैमिली इज कॉमनली कॉल एज द कॉटन फैमिली एज द कॉटन इज अ वन ऑफ द प्लांट फाइबर प्लांट्स व्हिच इज बिलोंग टू द मालवेसी फैमिली एंड व्हिच इज अ वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट एज अ इकोनॉमिक वैल्यू सो दिस इकोनॉमिक इंपॉर्टेंट वी हैड बीन डिवाइड इन टू फाइव डिफरेंट टॉपिक्स दैट इज फाइबर प्लांट्स फूड इल्डिंग प्लांट्स टिम्बर प्लांट्स मेडिसिनल प्लांट्स एंड ऑर्नामेंटल प्लांट्स सो लेट सी दी फाइबर प्लांट्स सो एज द मालवेसी फैमिली इज अ फाइबर इल्डिंग प्लान फैमिली सो दीज आर दी सर्टन इम्पॉर्टेंट स्पेसिज विच इल्ड द फाइबर्स गॉसिपियम बारबाडेंस विच इज ऑल्सो कॉल्ड एज द इजिप्शियन कॉटन देन गॉसिपियम हर्बेशियम विच इज कॉल्ड एज द एसियटिक कॉटन सो दिस इज द स्पेसिज विच इज अ largely cultivated in india specifically in maharashtra or the central india then gossypium hirsutum is a upland or the american cotton which are also cultivated in india also then gossypium arboreum is the only tree species which yield the cotton so this is the commonly called as a tree cotton so these four species are the main species which yield the cotton the cotton with fibers which are widely used for the making the fabrics your shirts your dresses or even a any cotton fabric has been made from the fibers which has been produced from the cotton and this cotton either the egyptian cotton asiatic cotton american cotton are widely used and cultivated in the india so this species are the gossypium barbadens gossypium herbaceum gossypium hirsutum gossypium arboreum so these are the four gossypium species which yield the cotton apart from these four species of the gossypium there are the certain species of abichelon which are also used for the fiber this abichelon indicum and abichelon polyandrum which is commonly called as the kangi and these plants or these species of the abichelon has been cultivated for the production of the stem fiber and these stem fiber are used for making the ropes so generally these rope making fibers are generally cultivated in the no northeast side of the india or the northern india that is specifically in a kashmir or a himachal pradesh so this abichelon indicum and the abichelon polyandrum these two species are cultivated for the stem fiber next one is the food yielding plants of the malvesi so malvesi family yield a very certain some vegetables which is abel moscus esculentus or the hibiscus esculentus which is commonly called as the bindi or the lady's finger or okra so these species are nothing but the abel moscus esculentus which is also called as it is a synonym is a hibiscus esculentus both names are a botanical name and both names are the synonyms so you can use either abel moscus esculentus or the hibiscus esculentus so which is commonly called as the bindi so tender fruit of the bindi are used for making the delicious vegetables then hibiscus cannabinus which is commonly called as the kinaf or the hemp so these leaves and the sepals of hibiscus cannabinus are used for making the tangy chutneys pickles jam jellies or even the veg veg table then hibiscus subdarifta is which is commonly called as patwa and it is also used for making the different vegetables and same the leaves and the sepals are used for making the tangy chutneys so these are the main and commonly used food plants which belongs to the family malvesi next one is the timber yielding plant in malvesi family a single species thespesia which is a represent the timber yielding plants which is a tree species and yield the timber which is generally used for the construction boat making and the other 
make uh, furniture making so this the special species is a use for yes use as the timber then the next one is the medicinal plants the medicinal pl plants belongs to the family malvesi are mainly abichulon indicum malva silvestris and althea rosea so leaves and the roots of the abichulon indicum are generally used against the fever even the uh, leaves of the malva silvestris are also used against the fever while the root of the althea rosea and the malva silvestris are combinedly or both are used for the whooping cough and the fever so these are the main medicinal nally important plants of the malvesi family then the next one is the ornamental plant so ornamental plants are nothing but the those plants which are planted in the garden to enhance the aesthetic value so generally it is a use for the beautification of the land or the area so out of the different plants of the malvesi family althea rosea which is commonly called as a hollyhock which have the bright colored flowers are used to increase the aesthetic value then he discussed rosa sinensis which is very common which is also called as the shoe flower or the china rose or in vernacular language it is called as the jasmine so this hibiscus rosa chinensis it's very popular for its beautiful flower and used to enhance the aesthetic value then hibiscus cyrupetalus are the one of the kind of the shoe flower but which has a dissected petals and this is also used for the enhancement of the aesthetic value so these are the economic important of the malvesi family